Yo, what's up? What's good, everybody? BQ here. Welcome back to the channel, the number one place to be for the Impact Wrestling fan. So make sure you are a subscriber. Wanted to drop this video on y'all real quick to talk about the announcement today that uh, Impact made that they have the Bound for Glory week coming up. I'm excited about this. This is the kind of thing that I've been begging for them to do. One of the things I've been wanting to see them do. Um, I and many of the fans have been critical over the years of the Bound for Glory build, the the lack of buzz, you know what I mean? It, it seems like they put so much in a Slammiversary and then Bound for Glory rolls around and it just feels no different than, you know, some of the other pay-per-views that they do. So I'm really excited with what they're announcing here because it's, it's something, it's something different. It's something to make Bound for Glory stand out and be special. So they're going to be doing after on the October 20th, after the episode of Impact, uh, Talk and Shop Mania with the Good Brothers. Um, this is going to, you know, this is already a popular series. It's going to be a pop, you know, continue to grow in popularity. Uh, you know, the AEW kind of ha has their um, being the elite thing. Uh, I don't know if it's them necessarily. I don't really want, I don't, I don't watch it. Um, you know, the with the Young Bucks and everything, which I think is a really good um you know, marketing tool. I think Talk and Shop Mania and what the Good Brothers do have it has it has the potential to have that kind of impact on Impact. So there's gonna be an episode of that after Impact, after the the television show. Uh, they're gonna sit down, and be talking to uh, fellow stars um, prior to Bound for Glory. So that should be good. Uh, Talk and Shop. I'm sorry, <laughs> I was reading the same thing again. Uh, this is Bound for Glory. That's gonna be on. Uh, October 22nd they're saying it's going to be the you know beginning of a documentary style series which this is what I'm excited about this is this is the type of shit that I've been saying they need to do on YouTube to where they're going behind the scenes with the champions and challengers so Eric Young, Rich Swan, Deanna Parrazzo and Kylie Ray doing a backstage um, you know behind the scenes Thing with them champions and challengers i think it's a really good way of making those two matches seem extremely important and you know allows us to build a little bit of a, a little bit of a stronger emotional connection to the matches to the wrestlers so that the matches mean a little bit more to us when we're watching them at home so i you know i've been wanting god you know i said when sammy callahan uh won the world title you know like and you know i'm always complaining about their youtube channel i'm like where's the behind the scenes stuff as the as the champion you know on youtube and where where's even the behind the scenes stuff of brian cage losing you know what i mean so i've been wanting to see this kind of thing for a long time because it 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 adds a degree of realism too like it can be kayfabe but there's a degree of realism as well so i'm looking forward to that quite a bit and then um they're going to do a live countdown show on the day of bound for glory on the 24th uh having it's, just, it's saying impact star is going to walk the red carpet which is cool because AEW does that for their pay-per-views and i was kind of like man i kind of would like to see impact do that you know um maybe it's a monkey see monkey do thing a little bit but um i think it's a cool thing to do for bound for glory uh, just you know just makes it makes it feel like a bigger deal makes it feel a little bit more special so i think that is cool it says um expert panelists are going to weigh in I don't have too much interest in in, in that because it's most likely um, Josh Matthews, uh, Don Callis, and Scott Moore expert panel. You know what I mean? Same same people we hear all the time. So can't say I'm super interested in that part. But you know, if they throw a couple other names in there, um, you know, who knows? That could be interesting. Uh, not my not what I'm looking forward to with all this. So and then it's going to be you know all this is going to happen leading up to the actual pay per view. And uh, leading up to the first match, so I hope that this uh, this portion of it—I don't know if it's going to be on Access TV. Um, it might have said that in the press release, or maybe it's it's a um, like a free pre-show on Fight TV. You know what I mean? Which I think would be extremely smart. I'm assuming that's what they're going to do, um, leading into the pay-per-view to where they're actually you know promoting it along the way, and that will that will get some more buys. You know, that just that's just going to happen. So uh, leave your thoughts in the comments for the uh what they're doing up to bound for glory the bound for glory week i think it's it's cool again um i'm gonna repeat myself on this i've been wanting to see this kind of stuff uh for years now um especially the the documentary style series that they're gonna do that's what i think is gonna be 
absolutely excellent and um, really want to know your thoughts. So let me know in the comments if it's your first time here. Thank you and I'm out. Peace.